is back. It is Sam. We are going today to build a robot. Or at least upgrade it. With this huge thing. <laughs> All right, it's done. It's time to talk. Hey, Ada. Hey. What can I do for you? Are you ready to install the radar beacon? Does it have to be you? I could install it on a different robot. My memory contains more relevant knowledge than any new robot you attempt to create. I appreciate your concern, but I can assure you I won't suffer any harm from the installation. So, are you ready? Time to operate. Just be certain you don't disconnect anything essential while you're rummaging through my circuitry. Once I'm in the robot workbench, just install the radar beacon and I'll do the rest. always fascinating watching you create. Hey. How may I be of service? A moment. The modification was successful. New hardware has been detected and software is updating. And installation complete. Analyzing mechanist hardware. The radar beacon is receiving a strong encrypted signal, but I can't determine the source. Do you think the mechanist knows we're tampering with the beacon? I've already added failsafes to ensure my location is secure, and prevent any unintended commands the signal may issue. Unfortunately, one of that will help us determine the signal's source. Damn. Then we've hit a dead end. Not necessarily. With some additional assistance, I should be able to decrypt the signal and locate the mechanist. Fortunately, I'm detecting another robo-brain in the Commonwealth that's receiving the same signal. Which means the one I destroyed isn't the only robo-brain under the mechanist's control. Yes, and we can use this to our advantage. The encryption on the source signal is complex, but not beyond solving. If you can bring me two additional beacons, they should provide the keys and algorithms that I need to enhance my decryption routines. This better work. Provided the human element doesn't fail, it will. I'm uploading the location of the Robo-Brain to your Pip-Boy now. Just be careful. These robots tend to travel in groups, so you're likely to encounter heavy resistance.
Hey, hey, hey. Yes. Here you go, Ada. One slightly dented, but still functional radar beacon. This will do nicely. And, with any luck, it'll help us trace the mechanist's signal. Remind me how this beacon will get us closer to tracing the mechanist's signal? Each Robobrain's radar beacon has unique encryption so that it can't be traced back to the source. However, acquiring two additional beacons should provide me with enough data to break the code. So if my theory is correct, this beacon will help us trace the mechanist's signal. Don't worry. I'm sure it'll do the trick. I certainly hope so. I'm going to begin my decryption routine, but it could take a while. In the meantime, I've picked up another Robobrain beacon signal. It should be the last one you'll need to collect. But Your astuteness is impressive. If my calculations are correct, the signal is coming from... Oh, this isn't good. Location confirmed. The Robobrain is at Fort Hagen Satellite Array, which means it's in the hands of the Rust Devils. Doesn't sound like anything a little lemon juice and some steel wool can fix. It's going to take something a bit stronger to overcome these foes. My old caravan encountered them once while crossing the river into the city. The Rust Devils are a group of ruthless raiders who utilize robots for their nefarious practices. They scour the Commonwealth looking for my kind. What they can't capture and reprogram, they strip for spare parts. I realize they pose a greater threat to me than you. I just want you to be well informed. That being said, despite what lies ahead, I can easily continue to decrypt the signal as we proceed. So shall we be on our way? Didn't expect help from a stranger. Thanks. I was just passing through. It was my lucky day, then. You wouldn't happen to know of any good places to settle around here, would you? I'm tired of always being on the run. Nah. 